Alright, what's up YouTube? Alright, what I'm doing here right now is basically I tried making these ratchets work. I tried making putting the guts of the 120 XP inside of the 84 tooth and here's the dealio. Alright, I have the 84 tooth gear set inside of here now. Here's the deal all wobbly if you can hear that it, it works but it's all wobbly so it's like one of them made main china ratchets that you get in them five dollar kits so anywho it works but it's not what you want <coughs> excuse me and anyways so we got this one here uh the deal with this one is Get the cover plate back on there. And then this, if you see the cover plate, the gear, it needs some machining. It needs to fit down further in there. So I was thinking maybe get a Dremel and just get it in there. Or possibly uh, Dremel the sides of the pin. And then it might have be able to have some room to pop in there but there's like very minimal clearance so i'm thinking some type of uh some type of dremel bit i have these here And I'm not sure if, if they will work. They might, it might work, but they might be a little too rough. I think because, yeah, they're pretty, pretty rough. Might be a little too rough, but we'll, I'll see on some practice metal. So that's that. I will show you guys one other quick thing. This is like a mail call. I was able to pick these up off of uh, <clears throat> Amazon this weekend for $22. The brand is Orbis, made in Germany, which Orbis is like uh, a Nipex sub company, I believe. Or it is Nipex, but a different division. I'm not sure exactly what their classification is. But these are your PWZ style pliers. They call it a Swedish pipe wrench. And this one's got the 45 degree angle. Usually they go straight out like that. Or like that. Like that, not like that. Which I think these are going to be a lot better than the other setup. So, yeah. This is pretty cool. Going to be able to get in there pretty good. Interesting, interesting stuff. Looks like there's still some something in there. Some type of grit. Interesting. It's grit, but it's there's still paint from there. So I wonder if they test these. Before they ship them out, because yeah, it's they they're fully painted. Chrome vanadium, uh, ra rosange rosange, forty five Germany Orbis. So yeah, we'll see how far they open up. So let's see, there's about a two and a half, two, two and a quarter, up to a two and a half, all the way down to a 
about two and a quarter all the way down here. So yeah, that these are these. It's pretty cool. I am going to get a pair of the the Baco slash Snap On PWZs. I'll get those in the probably the, the bigger version, and then the smaller version. Just keep these as my middle version. I guess you call them the number one version. So I'll get the number twos and the number zeros next. But just wanted to show you this. Oh, and these pliers, they kick ass. They work perfect for grabbing onto that. Grabbing onto this to see. And it, I went like that. And then I grabbed my pliers like that. And then, psh, so yeah. But it worked a lot better than that. Basically, yeah. <laughs> That's for you, basic. Anyways, toodaloo, over out, deuces. Give me some likes, give me some subs. Peace.